I wanted to create a short video on why lemon juice can be both good and bad for arthritis. Now that's kind of conflicting, so let me explain what I'm talking about. If we compare gout arthritis with osteoarthritis, there's two different things happening. With gout arthritis, you have high levels of uric acid. Now with osteoarthritis, you don't have uric acid, you have calcium deposits within the joints and you have a breakdown of the joints and you have inflammation. So gout symptoms get better when you make things more alkaline, okay? When you alkalize the body a little bit more. With osteoarthritis, you typically get worse when you make things more alkaline. And that's probably because of the relationship between calcium and pH. If your stomach, for example, is too alkaline, you will not be able to absorb calcium. So when you alkalize the body, you can actually create a flare up with arthritis. And as a side note, you can also create a worsening of allergies, by the way. So in osteoarthritis, you want to acidify the body a little bit more. And that's why we recommend apple cider vinegar. When you consume lemon or lemon juice and it gets broken down, metabolized, it actually turns alkaline. It turns into a base. So to lessen the pain and the attack and the precipitation of this uric acid, all you have to do, and this is a temporary thing, is alkalize the urine. Now with osteoarthritis, if you alkalize the body, you're gonna make it worse because of the connection between pH and calcium. For example, it takes a very acidic uh, stomach to absorb calcium. And if the body is a little bit too alkaline, calcium tends to precipitate out and get stuck in the joints. So with cases of osteoarthritis, they do better with apple cider vinegar to acidify the body. But with gout, they will do worse with apple cider vinegar. Now let's talk about lemon. So when you consume lemon juice for gout, the person usually feels a lot better because you lower the acidity. But for osteoarthritis, you make it worse because you make things more alkaline. So for osteoarthritis, use apple cider vinegar. For gout, use lemon juice. And by the way, that's just a temporary quick fix that'll make you feel better for a little bit. You wanna correct the underlying cause. Of course, high fructose corn syrup is at the top of the list with causing gout. Uh, people that are sensitive to purines. And I put a complete video on gout below. You should check it out if you have this because the true cause of gout is a sluggish kidney and you wanna keep working on your kidney. Now, as a side note, when you do intermittent fasting, your body will produce more uric acid as an antioxidant. And if you're sensitive to it, it could give you a flare up of gout. And this is why you could either do lemon juice or you can do potassium citrate to alkalize the body, to chill out this acidity and turn off that gout symptom. All right, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Hey, if you haven't already subscribed, press the button below and I will keep you in the know. Hey, that rhymes.